on the moon's there, coming through, kind of going through to the sun a little bit. It's a little yeah. bit off. Yeah. But it's not bad. She's right in the middle here. Yeah, I think they built that in mind, didn't they? Yes, that's yeah, what I'm trying to yeah, say. Yeah, yeah it, it's almost like. Psh. Yeah. This is for another. This is another date where they both correspond. Yeah. If you could find out where the moon and the sun corresponded within these caves, yeah. you might even have the, the date of, of being built. Yeah, that's a good point, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Because they, no, I know these were built towards the Taurus constellation and the Tuatha Dé Danann came up and upgraded it from the Neolithic, the Bronze Age, because they really revered Pleiades, and right. Pleiades is in Taurus. Right, I see. So, so that's yeah, why yeah, they yeah, liked yeah, it, and yeah. they upgraded That's what the Tuatha Dé Danann did, and also the Tuatha Dé Danann did the Gib Hill as well. Oh, uh, right. Those are more recent additions yeah, yeah. to the Neolithic. Stop and do something. It's all about that rhythm.